Good evening, 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 ladies and gentlemen. I welcome all of you back to another rage video where tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we are back again. Your master of reality, your bastard warrior of the bespoken, of the one. All of you here, back again. The society of the antisocial. We are, because like, quite frankly, uh, and one thing that's becoming a little bit clear uh, as we're going through this journey is that uh, the more things change isn't exactly what would I call an entirely social sort of song. I mean, listen, I've gone to school with, with I've, I've told you this before, I've gone to school with a guy who had an avenged sevenfold uh, bat, uh, satchel all the way through uh, my time at secondary school. Or that's like middle school and high school, basically. And... He, I, I reckon, honestly, from, from, from the few things I have heard about Avenged Sevenfold, I reckon you could, they could, they could, there's a... Again, I'm not entirely sure that's entirely fair to say to Machine Head, saying they don't really have a, lot, a following like that. I'm absolutely certain they do, and I reckon if you're a Machine Head fan out there, I do apologise in advance. And also because of the thing I'm about to say next. Um... The more things change, as far as, like, initial impressions go, because I've only ever heard one of a song, and I can't quite remember what it was, it's certainly... It's 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 a lot more... It's a lot harder than I remember, and... It's... it's a, I think that is. It's a little... It's a, not quite the sort of thing I would, like, immediately think I would, like, start to listen to, but you know what? In the interest of fairness, I'll stick through it, and... The first two songs on this album were absolutely fantastic. So, I want, to see, I want to see more of that. But, let's exactly see what Down to None is going to give us as well. Maybe it will do something kind of like similar to uh, uh, Struck a Nerve, where it will sort of like be a very anti-God sort of song, or it could, it could do something very strange, which it reveals like, Another like little dynamic that Machine had that wasn't like expressed before, but uh, you know what? Um, let's uh, let's find out for ourselves, shall we? So, if you guys want to check out the original video for yourselves, links will all be in the description down below. Let's begin. Down to none. In three, two, one, and I swear to God, every single time I try and do something, it fucks up, fucks me up. There we go. See, uh, right there again, this is sort of like a very different style to what Struck a Nerve was, because Struck a Nerve was short, but it was very straight to the point, which I, I kind of like that, because if you're going to have, if you're going to make a song which is uh, quite short, then you're going to have to get straight to it, you can't really afford to like hang around, and longer stuff uh, is, all, it's all well and good, because you know what, Things have to start off a little slow. It it kind of almost encourages the audience to be patient and to great almost appreciate more what's gonna come next, which leads me kind of like anticipating what exactly are they gonna do next. That's it. It it works out both in both ways for us, I for both parties. I sneezed. 
there you go. Um, I say there you go. We've got like just over two minutes left, but it's strangely, it's the the the. I think it. I don't know whether it's just the way Rob sings, uh, sings, or whether or not the way the lyrics like. There's no. I don't know if it's like. It it doesn't really have like a couplet or. It, it just, there isn't like any real like sibilance to all of this. It's it's told very straight. It's like very matter of fact in some ways. The only thing is, is that it's it's kind of told like a story without really. If this is like a story, if there's like no context involved whatsoever, which is not the worst thing in the world, but it's a very strange. And then again, this is their thing that they can do what they want of it. I'm not gonna sit here and say what uh, what Machine Head can and cannot do, but the music, even especially, has a very strange, very uh, unorthodox sort of switch in tempo or if or tune to it it's 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 almost like this song is like twisting very in, in a very strange way I, that's that's how i could describe down to none it's a it's a song that twists not 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 getting people to do the twist this song is twisting that's 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 something Imperium. Okay, that's that's a bit interesting. Um, right. Um, okay, there, ladies and gentlemen. That was that was uh, down to none by Machine Head, and um, um, I don't know how exactly I'm meant to put this, ladies and gentlemen, but um, I'm again, I'm like really, really not sure. Maybe it's because this is a lot heavier. This is a lot more of a heavier side. Is it? Isn't it something like metal core or something like that? They call it. Um, I, I'm. I'm. But I'm. I'm like. I'm struggling just a little bit. I mean, I get exactly what the intention is. That it's. But we we went from groove to like speed, and then we go straight to like really heavy stuff. But the problem is, I, I don't know if I get this is just again like my kind of like my kind of tastes or something like that. 
but it's so heavy that I, I, I don't know how to put it like loud equals good is it, that I, I don't want to say that's like the model we're going here but once you get past like the three and a half minute mark for like the next two minutes it's like the same note over and over again which isn't if you're gonna have like a song that for me for me okay if I was to write a if I was to write a metal song and if I wanted to have like uh, the same note over and over again. I would have it either so deep, but also kind of like a little bit like so silent, or have it so far in the background that it wouldn't even be worth noticing. Maybe I'd have like the song open up with like ten seconds of like. Do, 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 do. If that's not, that, no, no kidding, ladies and gentlemen. That is how I would probably write it. I'd probably have something that's, you know, it's there, but you're not focusing on it. In in down to none, there's almost, I was there was barely enough. There was barely anything I was like really like drawn towards because for the most part, down to none kind of is a little bit like a follow up to uh, struck a nerve and. Struck a Nerve isn't exactly my favorite song in the world either, which if, if you're a fan of Machine Head right now and you think I couldn't be any more wrong, feel free to let me know about it. I'm curious. Again, maybe this is just like a style thing and maybe really heavier stuff is not too much of a thing I would I would enjoy, but you know what? Different strokes. That, that, that's, that's literally all I could say. And... I think the problem as well with when it comes to these lyrics is that it's so basic as well. Bow down to no one, bow down to none. Straight down, been going, been sleepwalking in a violent haze. This world in ruin, the chain shackles like a foul disease. And then it just goes to this rage, this struggle, it is a feeling that's devouring. Calm break can't fucking give in. The pain will lead us through the blistering cold. Now, that's actually not too bad, honestly. It's it's compelling that it's involving a lot of viol it involves things like violence and how it's more of like is it more of about one person's like it does have like the, the idea of like somebody like going on a on a, like a berserker rampage. And I suppose maybe there is an argument to saying that the way that the, like the song structures that it, it's slow to anger and then devastating when it gets going, and it doesn't really like have a have a stop point. It's it's like you're, you're trying to keep this anger going for like so so long, and then it just I don't know if you could say it ends or it just fizzles out because no kidding, ladies and gentlemen, I've had fits like that before where I would be like pissed off for like the best part of ten minutes and then it would just go away like magic i'm not joking that's that's happened to me a few times before and i'm not ashamed to admit that but and i i don't and, and maybe that was the idea they were going for or maybe it could have been something else entirely um i will give machine head at the absolute credit if you know trying to do stuff for that's a bit a bit more different and maybe trying to replicate the idea of a rampage is a little bit harder harder than I'm trying to make it out to be. But I think it's just kind of, again, a bit like struck to nerve. I don't really have much else to say about it than that. I apologize if you're a fan of uh, Machine Head, and I'm, but I'm not entirely sure. I don't know whether it's just this album or the songs we're doing, but I think maybe something a bit... I, 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 don't, I don't know what it is. Maybe that will turn around. Because the first two songs, Ten Ton Hammer and Take My Scars, they were excellent. I had no problem with them. Because they the riffs were were so impressive and so fast that I'm, I, I still kind of have them a little bit jogged in my head even after five days. And they were brutal as well. They didn't hold stuff back. The problem is struck with my struck a nerve and down to none. They do try to make a statement here and there, 
but it seems like we want more of that. That would help explain it. But yeah, let's let's see exactly what goes up next. Uh, still their best album of all time, blew my mind at 14. 40, now this song still blows my now it still blows my mind. Well, maybe there will be more to come, but really realistically it's again not technically for me. So anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this reaction video. Please leave your thoughts and comments, your irate comments, especially if you are a long devoted Machine Head fan, in the comment section down below. And I will look forward to seeing all of you guys again in the next video. Take care and bye-bye for now.